Go to any department store and you will find a wide selection of the thousands of perfumes on the market. The fruit of the perfumier's art in extracting and then subtly blending hundreds of natural fragrances. The classic process is that of distillation, in which flowers or plants are placed on perforated trays in the upper part of a still and water in the lower part is brought to the boil. As the steam rises it captures the scent bearing components and carries them into a glass cooling worm where the mixture is condensed by refrigeration. The water and essential oils are collected in Florentine flasks where they separate due to their different densities and the lighter oils are scooped from the surface. Another technique is hot absorption or maceration, steeping flowers or plants in previously heated animal fats or oils, the mixture then filtered through fabric to obtain scented unguents. Extraction using volatile solvents consists of dissolving the fragrance bearing part of the plant in a solvent like ethanol or in former times ether, which is then evaporated to leave a highly perfumed paste. More recently, chemical processes have helped assure a consistent quality of perfume products, isolating the components of an essence and reproducing them, most often through petrol bry products. The first perfume to be produced using this technique was the celebrated Chanel No. 5 in 1925. These days, gas chromatography is used to identify the molecules and the quantities of each molecule that compose an odour, and allows the composition to be duplicated.